بسم اللہ الرحمن الرحیم السلام علیکم آئی ایم ڈاکٹر خالد ادریس آئی ایم این اسسٹنٹ پروفیسر اف ریڈیولوجی دس از این انٹروڈکٹری ویڈیو ٹو اور بیسک ابڈومینل الٹرا ساؤنڈ لرننگ کورس وی ہیو میڈ اٹ ویری سمپل ویری پریکٹیکل اینڈ ٹو دی پوائنٹ آئی اسٹرونگلی ہوپ دیٹ یو ول بیکم اے کانفیڈنٹ سنولوجسٹ آفٹر کمپلیٹنگ دس کورس ایون اف یو ڈونٹ نو دی اے بی سی اف الٹرا ساؤنڈ ایٹ دس ٹائم Let's have a brief introduction of this course. Now we have divided the course into five basic steps. You will start your journey from very beginning till you get your target at the end. In the first step, we will briefly discuss the basic principles of physics uh, which are responsible for ultrasound image formation. then you will learn the tissue identification on the basis of ultrasound physics its mean uh, which structures appear white which structures appear gray or black and why and what is the appearance of blood air lymph node stones and others second step is to learn the probe orientation in transverse plane it means when probe is placed with one end towards the right side of the patient and the other end towards the left side of the patient uh, then which structure appear on the right side of the screen which on the left side what appears in the upper part of the screen and what in the lower part of the screen uh, in this image we have placed the probe transversely in the right hypochondrium in this image uh, probe has placed transversely in the pelvis in the third step uh, you will learn the probe orientation in the longitudinal plane it means when the probe is placed in such a way that it that its one end is directed superiorly and its other end is directly inferiorly then which structure appears on the right half of the screen uh, which end of the probe represents on the left side of the screen what appears in the upper part and what is what appears in the lower part of the screen in the fourth step you will learn the technique and skills to identify and visualize an organ completely it is because when you become capable of tracing the complete anatomy of an organ it becomes very easy uh, to identify the pathology for example if you get successful in tracing the normal anatomy of the gallbladder then it will become very easy for you to identify the stone within the gallbladder Uh, in this step you will learn the patient preparation uh, required for the ultrasound examination you will also learn the patient positioning to trace the various organs then you will learn the probe positioning while performing the ultrasound examination it means when to move the probe superiorly and when to move the probe inferiorly when move right or when towards the left when to rotate the probe on one side or uh, to, uh, on the other side uh, then when to twist the probe uh, towards the left side and when to twist the probe towards the right side in the final step when you grip the normal ultrasound anatomy we will get you through the various pathological findings of each organ we will also guide you how to interpret these findings and what are their differential diagnosis after that it will be your passion and hard work that will complete your journey successfully thanks for watching this video uh, if you want to get yourself registered for this course uh, you can send your cv at our email address or uh, you can contact us on our numbers